Meghan Markle has had to adapt to many new rules since becoming a member of the royal family last year. But what is Meghan banned from doing in Morocco this weekend? The Duke and Duchess of Sussex have carried out two official overseas trips together as a married couple. They spent 16 days traveling around Australia, New Zealand, Fiji and Tonga last October, following a visit to Dublin last July. They will carry out their third trip abroad to Morocco this weekend before they welcome their first child in the spring. The royal couple will visit an equestrian centre, a cooking demonstration and tour the Andalusian gardens in Morocco over the next few days. But Meghan and Harry have been banned from taking part in their trademark walkabouts due to riots in capital city Rabat. Teachers have been protesting over pay and health care and this has sparked concern over the safety of the pregnant Duchess. Princess Diana's ex-protection officer Ken Wharf believes more demonstrations could take place close to the couple to gain more publicity. Mr. Wharf said to the mayor, planning a royal visit abroad relies heavily on trust and sound diplomatic contacts. From my own personal experiences our man will question the Moroccans' ability to deal with it. The fact that there is no royal walkabout is very telling. This would suggest that the UK protection team who did the original recce saw this as a red line. Meghan's pregnancy puts her own safety and that of the unborn child as a top priority. The couple's own security have asked for more resources in light of these events. Mr. Worf has also suggested Moroccan protesters are likely to demonstrate in close proximity to the couple to gain more publicity. He said, Executing an evacuation is naturally fraught with dangers. One thing is for sure, Meghan's propensity for getting among the crowds will not be encouraged on this trip. British security services have also reportedly called for extra resources to protect the couple this weekend. If the couple are believed to be facing danger, they will be quickly removed from the situation or even the country. MI6 has also requested a report from Morocco after the riots in Rabat. This will be passed to the head of royal protection at the Met Police, according to sources.